I've got a low GRE score. I need more time to plan my study abroad journey. I won't admit only to a top university. We hear this often. If you're one of those who are planning to take a drop year to plan your study abroad journey, this video is for you. In this video, we will be discussing if taking a drop year is really a good idea for you and what are other options that you can explore instead of taking a drop year. Can a drop year be beneficial for your study abroad journey? It totally depends on how you utilize your drop year. It can definitely be beneficial if you want to take more time to think about what you really want from life or study and get better grades or volunteer and contribute to society or do things like that. You can also do some internships or build network. All of this can lead to a wholesome profile for your study abroad application. So there is no solution that fits everyone. It totally depends on you how you handle it. So now the question comes, how to utilize your drop year better to get top admits? First of all, do not stress or worry too much about taking a drop year. There is nothing wrong in taking a drop year if you are very confident you can get better grades or better scores in your tests. Here are some things you can do to make better use of your time. Number 1. Get better scores in tests. Make a detailed study plan. Stick to it sincerely and give as many mock tests as you can in order to get better GRE, TOEFL or IELTS results. Number 2. Internships. In case you are a fresher or if you are planning to change your major in your masters, then do consider taking up an internship. Internships are a great way to beef up your resume. They will offer you relevant experience in the field of your interest. Number 3. Aprende una nueva idioma. That means learn a foreign language. 4. Pursue online courses and upgrade your skills. Consider volunteering or fellowships. And lastly, pursue hobby so that you can manage stress well and it's good for your overall personality development. Do universities look down upon a drop year? No, your drop year will not have any negative impact on your admits. Most universities appreciate the maturity, motivation and additional skills that you have acquired during your drop year. Of course, you must be able to express your journey in a convincing manner in your SOP. When to avoid taking a drop year? Well, if you are too sure that you can pull off a better admit by taking a drop year, then go for it. In case you are worrying too much about wasting time or you get traced out real easy or if you are a procrastinator and lack the discipline that it requires to make better use of your free time, then you must reconsider your decision. Analyze yourself well, understand your behavior patterns and only then take a call. What are your other options instead of taking a drop year? Can you fix your test scores real quick? Then give it all you've got and fix your scores quickly. Look out for waivers. Many universities waive off the GRE test score for admissions. Deepen your research to find out such universities. You can also use Yorkets College Finder tool with a link in the description below. See if any extra skills or additional degrees can fill up the gap. And lastly, write an extraordinary SOP. Universities tend to take in consideration an overall profile of a student. So make sure you narrate your stories convincingly. And you might as well just land in your dream university. Don't self-reject. Try before you say, I can't do it. Your kid pro tip. Whatever you decide, remember, your path is different than everybody else's. Whatever worked for the other person might not work well for you. So make your decision very carefully. Studying abroad is a critical decision and involves a huge investment of time, resource and money. So make sure you are fully prepared and convinced with whatever decision you take. Hope this helps. If you have any further question, type it in comments below and we will have it answered from our experts. If you like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel. Do let us know if you have confusion or doubts regarding any other area and we will take that up in our next video. Next video dropping soon. Stay tuned. Ta-da!